speed cameras. Oh god. What is this? Some kind of border crossing. Oh no. No! <laughs> I want to go that way. I don't want to go this way. Game, why have you done this to me? Right, I've got an idea. This is an off-road truck, right? We got this. Do you look how easy that turns over? Did you see that? Uh-oh, I'm stuck. I think I might be hitting an invisible wall. <laughs> this is not going to plan. This is supposed to be an off-road monster right here. Looks like the drive wheel. There's only one drive wheel and I can't control the diff lock. Look at this. Don't you do it to move! Look at it rocking! Oh my god! That is insane! Why is that trailer rocking like that? What is that? That's crazy! Why is my trailer doing this? There's flashing traffic lights over us here. This is definitely some kind of police border crossing thing going on. Yeah, he's been pulled over. Right, this is the back road there. This is going to get interesting. Whoops. Completely the wrong gear. The truck's top speed sucks. I'll be honest with you, it hasn't got that much power either. Oh, hello! Hello! I'm beginning to think I just came the wrong way. <laughs> oh, there's a massive rock in the way. Oh, it's alright, I drove through it. TW Gaming 4455. Thank you for subscribing. I need a photo. Thank you for subscribing, TW. Let me give you a, a toot in a second. Where's the sun? Behind me, annoyingly. <laughs> we need a photo of this. You'd rather use thermite. Oh, you've got some of that in the cupboard. Oh, okay, yeah. Use thermite then. Oh my god! Are you actually kidding me? What the heck just happened? Ooh, a Mac. Ooh! Ooh, a Mac. With tyres sunk into the floor, no less. They concreted it into the showroom, apparently. Uh, cabin options? None. Chassis options. None. <laughs> Engine options. None. It's good. It's very thorough. Transmission options. With a retarder. Interior. Any colour you want, as long as it's this colour. Stock colour, we'll leave it as black, change it in a minute. Accessories, ooh, we've got accessories. Right, I was beginning to get word there. Yeah, there's definitely a bug going on with that shadow. <laughs> What's this about? What's that wheel shadow for? In fact, hang on, that's in the wrong place. Yeah, I'm thinking about it, look. Whoever wrote this didn't modify... I know what's going on here. Whatever truck it replaced... It's using the same shadows from the previous truck. So the front wheel would have been here and the rear two would have been there. <laughs> That's brilliant. Oh, the packed glass. I've not seen that for ages. That would actually take us into Brazil. Look at that. We'd have to drive through Denmark, across Germany, through the Netherlands, down to Calais, take the ferry, 
into Santos and drive up to Ap Aparecida. If we're going to take that, though, we'd have to go with a different colored truck because that wouldn't look good. A green Pilkinson's glass. The reason I like Pilkinson's glass, guys, is because Pilkinson's headquarters... Basically, Pilkinson's is a glass manufacturer whose life started in St. Helens, which is where I was born. I think that's more or less the Pilkinson's green color. It's going to be slightly off, but it can't be that far off. I still don't like the front wheel. <laughs> well, you know, I'm not that far off. That wasn't a bad guess. <laughs> Wow. MLG? Oops. <laughs> right, come on. Come on. Tell me you're not impressed by that. Tell me you are not impressed by that colour matching. Are you actually kidding me? Look at that shot. That's pretty impressive colour matching right there. <laughs> the design is meh. Not on this truck. This truck looks beast. Wow, that retarder is pretty good. All oh, that view, that scenery has to happen. Try and get it in focus. Yes. One man, one windmill. <laughs> oh, lovely view. Trying to get the framing right. There we go. Do some serious role playing. Oh, you know what I'm like when I'm. Actually, you've not seen me role play properly, to be fair. You have no idea of my, my role playing prowess. I've done lots of role playing with my DD &D days. DD, &D, I used to role play elves, dwarfs. Actually, I didn't play dwarfs that much. Humans and, and elves, I, I used to role play a lot of. Uh, drow, that kind of thing. No, I don't do cosplay. You see, that's that's where I draw the line. Like, I like... I like cosplay events. I like people that cosplay. But me, personally, I tend not to. I mean, dressing up isn't so bad. Like, cosplaying isn't so bad. But it's fine, actually. But <laughs> what I'm saying is... Were, some of my friends that we used to do D&D &D with... They used to go and... Do the whole real-life roleplay thing. Where you would dress up like cosplay and then go around the woods and camping and casting spells at each other and I, I just found the whole thing a bit weird like one of my friends would dress up as a monk yeah the other one would dress up as a wizard and they would go around they would go around the uh, the woods and the, and the fields and stuff encountering people who were dressed up as orcs and they would have combat situations. And while they're having combat, yeah, and like some guy stood there reading out a, a fireball spell, and some orcs are coming in, attacking them. There's somebody walking past behind with the dog because they're in a public place. So, all of this, what they're doing is in a public place, but there's people just walking past with dogs going, What the hell are they doing? <laughs> I, I just couldn't. I couldn't do it. I drew the line, real life role playing is on the other side of the line. Oh, what a lovely, lovely, lovely orange trim. Mm mm mm, that's so nice. Black beige. Classy. <laughs> Classy. Route 66. Hang on, there's no difference. Sports. Oh my god, that is so obnoxious. Oh, I'm definitely having that. 
That is full on obnoxious. Look at that. That's like being inside of a bee. Black and yellow. It just needs some stripes. Bzzz. <laughs> God. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like banana milkshake. But I don't want to sit inside one. Oh. Look, the banana shows up from the outside. That's so cool. We can see the banana. That's brilliant. Hang on a minute. Boom! <laughs> I don't think that's going to work. Boom! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Do you reckon that would actually drive? I don't, I don't think that would drive. What is this? Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? BCS, my PC is broken because I see Paul and a yellow banana peel ran out. I think my eyes are cheating me. No, <laughs> you see the truth, BCS. What is this? Why do they all look like they're holding a wheel or something? Where was that guy? He looks like he's crying. Him. He just looks like he's he's like he's like it's like Oliver. He's like holding his hand going, please, sir, I want some more. That is awesome. 63 grand, that's all it cost me. The euro cost me 94. Oh! I don't believe it! The game rejected the Renault. Even Euro Truck went, nope. Uh uh. Let me try. Hang on, I've got an idea. Let me try configure it. I think it. This is getting weird. <laughs> I reckon it was something to do with that um, that wheel, that axle. I think that's probably what caused it to go. Nope. So what if we just stick to the normal one? I think we're going to have to, unfortunately. Okay, so far so good. No, <laughs> it actually takes that. That's fine. We'll build it back up. We shall rebuild this Renault. What colour do you want to paint it, guys? Do you want it to be bubblicious? <laughs> Tiger skin? Oh my god. Do you want pumpkins? What would you never put on this? You want pink? Hang on. Where's the... Uh, there it is. Is that a good look? I think... Pink with flowers. There isn't one with flowers. I can't do one with flowers. What was that? Hang on a minute. What the heck is this? There's something wrong with the starter motor. This is like a drag race... Look at that turning circle though, look at that! That's like a taxi, what the hell? Look at the state of that! That is the smallest turning circle on a truck I've ever seen, that is ridiculous. There's another option. Glasgow. Ooh, Glasgow to Torino. Oh, that's a good... <gasps> Do you know what the... Oh, my God. Do you know about that one? That goes through the Swiss Alps. That'll be an absolute nightmare, which basically means you're all going to go, yes, do that. Like, you're all saying Inverness, but any second now, you're going to go Glasgow. Because I know for a fact that that is a nightmare stage for the, for the Bobab. Total. 
There you go. I, saw, I knew you'd say that. I, like, I knew you'd go for that one. Because you guys just want me to do the most difficult thing ever. Okay, Mr. Renault, we're on our way to Glasgow. Look <laughs> at the suspension. Watch it go over this. Wow. Why well, have I got a different size front wheel? Because <laughs> that's what the Renault dealer specced out. Okay, we may have knocked it there. Spotify 96, seven months hype. Thank you, Spotify. No percent damage for the win. <laughs> no percent. How does that even work? What oh, gets off the Scania? Honestly, this red. <laughs> This Renault was a nightmare to drive. Just keeps going for everything. I like the way it's actually horizontal going down a slope. That is beautiful. That is poetry. I need to find a hill again. That was absolutely amazing. If you're in this truck and you go down a hill, you're actually sat perfectly flat. And they're being overtaken an awful lot. Right, here you go. Watch. This guy's going to overtake me up this hill. Go on, pal. I dare you. I double dare you. You went for it, pal. Nobody overtakes the Renault. No. Kiss my boobab. Try steering while you're in this kind of camera view. I don't even know what's on the other side. Oh my god. Give me <laughs> I was like, why is it going to flick camera? Come on, come on, come on. And boom, straight into a wall. I bet that's damaged something. Oh no, 5%, 7%. No. We're not meant to go up that ramp, are we? Yes. Oh god. It's a Renault, it's got special dispensation. He's allowed to do this. If there's anything behind me, then I can't see it anyway, so it doesn't exist, right? Like, for example, the guy that I think we've hit. I didn't feel it. Did you? I didn't feel a bump. I don't see anybody in the mirror. We want to go this way. God. I think he's coming with us. I don't think the Mini actually wanted to go up this lane. I think he wanted to go straight on. Oh dear. Test but a scratch. That's pretty cool. Still not moved. That guy's so weird. Why are you no crash? I'm I'm waiting for the moment, Q8. I'm waiting for the moment. Mm -hmm. Renault has right of way. Oh, I can't fit around there. Oh! Oh! Quite a big man. It's okay. Sorry about that. It's just a little scratch. We'll, we'll send you. Um, yeah, just send the bill. We'll, we'll paint it up for you. It's fine. 
Silent Bob, Paul's new co-driver. Is that Silent Bob? Is that his name now? Meet Silent Bob. Look, we're going downhill and it's perfectly flat. That's beautiful. Uh-oh. The engine broke going downhill. You could do with the service as well, never mind fuel. I'm just going to park up here, guy. You probably won't be able to get out in the morning, but that's not my problem. Uh, I don't think that twigged. It's not letting me sleep. I think it might be a, a bug. Might have to detach the trailer. There you go. Now I can sleep. <laughs> just leave just leave a massive trailer in the fuel station next to this guy so he can't get out and then go to sleep. Absolute genius. Hopefully we'll wake up to some sunshine. Yay! And this guy's still trapped. Poor fella. No way. What's your Instagram name? School.tv. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Mayday. Mayday. <laughs> oh, it's okay. We've got traction. I need to get myself off the railing. That's a nice looking run up. Well, it'd be a shame if something were to happen to it. I'm glued to this thing, apparently. There we go. Suddenly the Freddie Mercury song, I Want to Break Free, comes to my head. Thank you for joining the community. Let me give you a toot. What the heck? Well, there's the Renault horn in action. <laughs> Move fade from Sabrina. Whoa! Don't know how that happened. Is he here? Oh, it's banana! Hang on. I need a photo. I've got to get a photo of this. Two banana trucks. How often does this happen? <laughs> I've got more blancmange on my trifle than custard. He's all about the custard. I suppose you want to get back in this lane now, don't you, pal? I hope you don't want to turn right like I do. Because if you do, you're in big trouble. Just saying, bro. Just saying. Are we slowing down? What? Crash vehicle? What? I didn't hit a vehicle. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> I went through that a little bit too quick. More damage may have been caused. Let me see what we're on. Oh, we're only on 17 and 22 percent. It's all good. We've got a long way to go yet before we're finished there with this weather. Watch him pull out. I knew it. Now, tell me that the AI has not got more stupid. Like, why would that? AI, why would that even happen? I'm staying external camera so we can see the scenery a bit better. Because this is all the pro mod, new model stuff. Off roading for the win. Look at this irrigation stuff going on here. Don't remember seeing that in um, Euro Truck before. That texture's flickering now. Look at that. Look at this. This is like so cool. It's just all been cut out of the ground. That is awesome. Look, all the cows live on an island and that one's floating. That cow's floating! <laughs> They're all just stood on these little islands trapped by water. That is brilliant. It looks really cool though. <laughs> it's a beautiful truck. I'm still convinced the person who replaced the front wheel puncture put the wrong size tyres on. But they insisted they were the right ones. I'm 
sure they got the wrong size. Why is the exterior of the lodge so polished? Oh my god! <laughs> I could not stop. Oh well. I can't get off the truck! See you later! Bye! What do you mean crash vehicle events? I already hit it once, you can't charge me twice for hitting the same thing. Ridiculous. I just got billed twice for hitting the same guy. How does that even work? I'm gonna wait up. I'm gonna have to use the other side of the road to do this. And even then, I don't know if we're gonna make it. Oh, no, we're not gonna make it. Due to the bounding box on this thing being ridiculous. Just go like that and then swing a right like that. Come on! Engine malfunction, perfect timing, just when I need some power. Is it gonna fit under here? Oh it fits under there, that's fine. I was a bit worried then. Oh low air pressure again, are you kidding me? This truck has low air pressure problems, guys. I think what happens is, whenever you start it up, it has to pump the uh, front tires back up again. The shine, the sheen on that log, we varnished it before we took off, look. We varnished the, we cut it down and varnished it. That's what happened. Full retarder and low gear, and it still just wants to fly down here. This is a big old tree. Is that going to take that? Yes, no, maybe. No, apparently not. Where the heck does this want to be? I actually don't know where the... where the hitbox is for this. Is it here? Oh, there it is. What? <laughs> Just put the back wheels in and it's fine. Right, test drive limited, four of seven. Damaged, lost four, 89 grand. Look at this, I got nothing. I got no XP and no money at all for that entire journey. That is grim. 36% damage penalty and I lost everything. Unbelievable. Well, you know what I think? <laughs> Know what I think of that stupid thing? I'll admit, I wasn't expecting that. Where did Moreno go? Oh my god. He's gone into the abyss? I've lost my truck? Would it... Malfunction? 
Is he is he in the sand? What am I gonna drive home in? <laughs> Somebody bring back my Renault! Okay, I mean I didn't, you know, it was a bit of fun. I didn't actually want to have no truck to walk okay. Alright guys, well it looks like I'm walking home. So um yeah, I won't be driving back, so I'll be walking back home tonight. <laughs> Make my way out of the quarry.